guys, Sung here with another Excel tutorial. This time I'm actually doing something for uh, my CPA. Uh, I was with him recently looking at my taxes and we were talking about Excel and he asked me a question about macros and how can you rename a macro. So I'm making this video for him and anybody else who is wondering that. It's, it's a very easy thing but you have to know where to go. So what I've done here, it's a very simple sheet. I just made a simple addition macro. And now I'm going to go ahead and change it. So the first thing you need to do is find out where to look up the macros. And if you didn't know that, if you're going through your toolbar here, uh, view, you see the macros over here. If you happen to have the developer section turned on, it would be right here. OK, so we're going to go ahead and go to macros you can see here that my macro name is one um, how I'm gonna go ahead and change that is just go to edit and you can see here sub which stands for subroutine macro one and then you can see the actual specifics of the macro here this is what you need to change and you just name it whatever you want to do adding cells and, and it can be virtually anything that you want it to be. Uh, generally, you want to keep it as one string of characters. And then you just go ahead and come back here. And then if I come back out here, now it's changed to adding cells. And then you have your list of macros. So in this case, I go ahead and delete that out. I want to run the adding cells. And then there it worked. So that's how you can rename macros. Hopefully it's been helpful. Uh, if it has, uh, go ahead and leave a comment. Also, take the time to ask some other questions about Excel, things that you've been wondering, if you can do it, how you can do it. Uh, I'm just looking for things that people actually need uh, that maybe I might be able to help out with. So anyway, have a great day, and we'll see you next time.